hello everybody my name is rahul and in this video we'll be looking at a challenge called traveler in the integrity ctf capture the flag competition now it says beach sun and sea what more do you need now we are provided with this ip on uh, this uh, host address and as you can see we have a beautiful website here now one of the things that you'll try to do is you'll try to click on each and every button and see where it is taking you now if i hover over the packages you'll see that in the bottom left corner that it is redirecting me to packages.html then this is to blog.html and we have more like about us testimonials and responsible disclosures now one of the things that you can also try to do is click on contact us and see if you are um, able to submit any form now for this i'll try to what i'll try to do is let's just type name are at the uh, with the subject of sub and what we'll try to do is we'll see if a request is sent indeed a post request was sent now what can we do now in this scenario you can try to do a bunch of things you can uh, if the input is unsanitated uh, is not sanitized properly you can also try for cross site scripting attacks and get the admin's cookie but here in this challenge what we had to do is look for the flag now one of the things that i look for is try to i try to enumerate as much as i can so that i get a idea about what the website is trying to do now here you'll see that we are under the packages section and we have a button now if i were to click on sync or couple and click on submit it you will see that it says spots left are 12 now uh, the rest of the things except for contact us and this uh, page in the packages section everything is just static now the only thing that is dynamic here is the packages uh, this this section so what it is trying to do is let me just turn on my intercept and let's click on submit now here you will see that there are two parameters going and something is happening in the background and we're getting a dynamic result back though the result is just the same now here what you can try to do is you can just also try to look for any scripts available just to see that if this is static which, which what i mean by that is if i click on single was is it actually taking the content from the javascript and then fetching me back but here we just saw that it is making a post request so let's just try to tamper with the request now what i can try to do here is click on uh, just type in a commas and anything that can eventually produce an error now as you can see it is executing bash check.sh and single and here are our apostrophes and a double quotes so let's just try to intercept the request again and let's just add ls in the home directory but here we'll also be adding ampersand so that we don't break anything so let's just forward the request and here you'll see that we have flag.txt in the root directory so let's just intercept it again space and cat flag.txt let's just try to encode it so that we don't break anything forward it and here you'll see that we get and i must have typed something wrong so let's just do it again and cat flag dot text let's just try to send it again here you'll see we get the flag thank you guys